Hey, what is going on, Pokey lovers? And welcome back to the Emerald No Evolutions run. So, we are deep in the Aqua Hideout, and we've got a choice of two teleports here. From what I vaguely remember, we cleared out the vast majority of the left teleport. So, let's see how we get on here. Oh man, we could have done that all along? Hell yeah. Right. That rules out there. Ah. Who is up first? Nice dog. We'll take that. Okay. I think if we go left, that was for the Master Ball, right? Pretty sure we've cleared a lot of bozos out here. Yeah, looking familiar here. I think it was just past here we turned back, right? Nice. War panels to hideouts, pride and joy. You're clueless about where you are, aren't you? Fluster and tire out the enemy, then lower the boom. That's our plan. Well, your plan failed because we've beaten one of you already. Grunt. Zubat. Spark. Death. Yeah. Gotta love the old four-word battle. Done. Shut up. What's wrong with you? You're not tired at all. Go on, Doc. That reminds me, I can't remember where I put the Master Ball. It's in my pocket. If I fail to guard it, our boss will chew me out. Oh, yo. No. You're kidding. Okay. Very, very interesting. Right, guys, looks like this is the finale. Wondering if we do actually want Doc up front. You would imagine so. Oh, don't tell me we need a Pokemon who can serve. Lucky we've got one. Worked out well. Wait, is he down there? I think that is where he is. Can we see him? Yeah, nice. Right, let's do this. Unfortunate setback. Okay, just here, right? Nice guys. You'd imagine this is the leader, right? Pretty sure we've explored everywhere else. What's his name? Archie or something, right? Yeah! Got here already, did you? We underestimated you, but this is it. I'm a cut above the grunts you've seen so far. I'm not stalling for time, I'm gonna pulverize you. That is a very weird shadow behind him. Is that the submarine, I guess? Okay, Aqua Admin Matt. So he's not too. Oh, this is bad. As well, go for Spark. If we're lucky, we get the Paralyze anyway. Very nice. Now, Doc is still quite weak though. First turn Paralysis, that is amazing. Um, I think if you do Charm on the same gender, it just lowers their attack. So let's just Spark again. We may get a crit. That was decent. Oh my god. Look lucky. Did I do a full roost? Nice. Full roost all would have sucked. Go on, crit. Oh, come on. Hell yeah. It won't kill. 
Oh, three in a row. Good stuff. Save your PP, Doc. Mm, love that. Golbat, hell yeah. Look at Doc just ripping his team to shreds. <sighs> that May flinch. Didn't. We might get lucky here. Ah, oh, Golbat is an evolved form. Very nice. Love that payoff. Yeah, we get to go first because it's paralyzed and the speed is slashed. Go on, Doc. Damn, you like that? Mm. Yeah, so I lost too. Big money. Hee hee, while I was toying with you, our boss got through his pre preparations. Damn. Our boss has already gone on his way to some cave under the sea. If you're going to give chase, you'd better search the big wide sea beyond Lily Cove. But will you find it then? Nice, so the whaleman's finally pissed off. Excellent. Did Doc? He did take a scratch, unfortunately. Yeah, confirmed. Okay, we just leave now. Nice. This hideout is so much less annoying than the magma hideout. I mean, if for some reason you despise teleports, or warps, whatever you want to call them, more than constant random encounters, then you do you, I suppose. Oh, we've got a complete... well, we'll heal up anyway. We should probably let Stegs out to play. I was wondering why we had him in the party at all, but he is actually a HM user, from what I recall. Nice guides, guaranteed progression, and we're only 70, uh, seven minutes in. Lovely. Maybe that's not too wise to do out on the wide open sea. Yeah, that could potentially be quite silly. Okay. So if that's the case, we better do a type check. So, good. Should be fine. Ah, we better get rid of him just in case. Potentially swap cocktail for stags, but now nah, that is just the same problem, right? Okay, who are we getting? Who's coming out for us, sir? Uh... So we don't want him. Um, we don't actually have a psychic type, so that could be decent. Oh, yo, 37's a bit OP though. Seven. Not much we can do, right? Yeah, psychic time might be a good bring along, I think. Okay, so at least we've got no water weaknesses. Now we'll just see what else we want to bump into. Of course, thousands of tentacles, never forget that. Yes, amazing. Okay, let's check the list before we set off. Perfect. Nice. Now we can hydrate while we check the map. Let's see what's coming up, guys. Route 124. That is going to get us... Potentially something. Okay. 
Now, I'm not sure why the water's so dark here. That may be yet another barrier. So potentially we're going straight for Moss Deep City. So one, two, four. So all of this is one, two, four. Nice. And we've got a little bit of one, two, five. Which apparently gets us nothing. Nice. Right, guys. Let us press on. Let's up it up, Kip. Hell yeah. Starting off with a doubles. Are you for real? I'm growing bored of swimming. How about a battle? Don't have six. Swimmer Grace. With the Mariel. Okay, just as well we've got a level 37 or two in our pocket. Nice. Always good to be quicker than it. Go on, dog. Job done. I had no idea that you were this strong. We just swim in front of him, that's fine. Here I am swimming by my lonesome on this wide, beautiful sea. There's no other word for it. This is pathetic. God damn, that swerved. Oh, he's gonna go on about like, the beauty of nature. And how is he on his own if, um, this is a doubles battle. Wee, swimmer Declan, go on. The Gyarados, why have you forsaken me? Right, that is fine. So, we should potentially go for the guaranteed paralysis, but screw it. Gyarados is usually really quick. Interesting that we were quicker. Damn, one shot to take that. In. Apologies, Nick. I'm feeling blue, blue as the sky. I should chat up lady swimmers and invite them on a long swim. There's one across the way you're doing the doubles with. All the effort you put in must have made you this strong. Oh, yeah, what's that? Could this potentially be related? Aha! So one of the things we can catch here, well, I'm not sure if it's this exact spot, but it may potentially have to do with those three secrets we were looking for a while back. Now, the note next to it says Route 124 and 26, and then it just says C, Aqua Block. Now, this looks very much like an Aqua Block, but this may be the gimmick where we unfortunately need to try and catch an evolved Pokemon who will know to move Dive. Uh, potentially there's no other way to get that move. The thing I looked up didn't say, you know, just get TM Dive. Yes, Hyper Beam, it's official. Nah, it's not looking good. Unless Dive is a HM we just haven't got yet. Where are we at? Yeah, we should try and go south, right? Is it just blocked off? It's looking like it. Damn. Let's just try and find the city for now. If we can just get there. Is this it? Could this be it? Yeah. What is this? Hunter's house? Go on then. I'm the diving treasure hunter. I'm the awesome dude who makes deep sea dives to gather treasures resting at the bottom. You haven't got any treasures for me. If you see any shards like the red shard, you've got to trade it with me. 
Okay, wonder where on earth we get those and what they do. Keep it going. A level 13 tentacle? Why such a vast power difference? My god, that one was 34. Hey, this is looking good. Yeah, look at them trees. Uh, he looks nasty. Oh, yo, he looks nastier. Around Moss Deep, you can see Wild Whalemer. It's called, uh, what was it now? Way, 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 whale we're watching. Hey, I see what you did there. Oh, actually, if that's the case... Ah, nice. That is actually the Pokémon we have to use, but it's, it's evolved form. Which apparently is only on... Route 129. So it's still quite a way to go, unfortunately. That's fine. No problems there. But it does mean if we can be asked to try and get whatever those secrets are, that that's going to be like right before the end game. Which, yeah. If you've had a whole team up until that point, it's a tricky one. I got this from Stephen, but I don't know what it's good for. I think it's called King's Rock. Do you want it? Why would you want it? You're weird. You can keep it, but keep it a secret from Stephen. Okay. What is it? Stephen's house is right over there. Let's have a look. Nope. Is it something that helps you evolve? item that may cause flinching. Yes. Excellent. Give that to Git. I like that a lot. My little brother says he likes to go find people's secret bases. You should make a secret base somewhere. I'll go find it. Stay out of my house. See what Steve has to say. Hmm, your minimum. It likes blue poker blocks, doesn't it? No, I'm positive it definitely likes blue poker blocks. My husband can tell what kind of poker blocks a Pokemon likes at a glance. Damn, that's got to be really helpful if you were into that stuff. The island space center has been launching huge rockets. Whoa, Pokemon in space? There's been some kind of an uproar over a letter they received recently. I heard from a sailor buddy that Team Aqua set up shop in Lily Cove. I also heard that someone came along and wiped the floor of them. But Mosty Piers been targeted by that Team Magma. If you want to know what they're up to, go visit the Space Center. Okay. What is all this? I can explain game rules to you if you like. Which game should I describe? Neither. No time for mini games now. All life needs to see to live, even though it makes its home on the land. Life, having run its course, becomes soil and returns to the land, and the sea is always connected to the land. Yes, like the very shoreline here. Hmm, take that. That'll help for the water Pokemon that we'll be catching later on. Morba, feeling good? I'm doing great. I heard Moss Deep's gym leader is pretty strong, so I decided to come take a look-see for myself. But there's something wrong about this town. People are going on about a warning letter in the space center. I don't think it concerns me in any way, though. Damn, and he's off. This rock has a special meaning to the people at the Space Center. They put it here as their wish for their rockets to fly safely. When you make a wish, what do you use? Do you wish upon a star? I use a wish tag to make it happen. That's what I do. 
Wouldn't it be nice if the whole world was covered in plants and flowers like this island? Hell yeah, it would. Hey there, trainer. A super rod is really super. Say what you say all you want, but this baby can catch Pokemon off the sea floor. What do you think? You want it, don't you? You bet, you bet. After all, a super rod is really super. Nice. If there's any water, try dropping in your rod and see what finds. Right, let's check the list. Did we actually need that for anything? Potentially we do, but we'll see what happens. A voyage on a ship is fine, but crossing the sea with Pokemon using Surf? Now that's an exhilarating trip, wouldn't you agree, youngster? Okay, uh, I think we were in here. No, we were not. My little sister exchanges mail with her boyfriend in Fortree. I don't envy her one bit at all. Even though I can't see my friend in Fortree, my Pokemon carries mail back and forth for us. I'm not lonesome, even though we're apart. That is a well-trained wing girl. Oh, actually. Yeah, you know him. A single secret. I was taking a stroll down the beach when I found this. It's not anything I need, so you can have it. Right, that sounds like you would evolve with that. The Hoenn region has been famous for its meteor showers for a long time. Some people claim that Pokemon came from space. Could it be true? Norba, have you read that proclamation already? Team Magma is coming after the rocket fuel on this island. I don't know what they need it for, but they can't be allowed to take it. I'll keep an eye on things for a little while longer. In the meantime, why don't you check out the town? A rocket launch demands perfection. Not even a 1% margin of error is allowed. Even if it's 99% okay, the whole thing is useless if 1% happens to be no good. Despite that, we never stop trying. Why? It's a dream that never ends. The rocket launched safely. That successful launch, number 43. Damn, it's like SpaceX up in here. A giant chunk of metal bursts through the skies and flies into space. It boggles my mind. If only I was a little younger, I would have liked being an astronaut. No, it's not too late. I can't and will try. Moss Deep has mainly sunny weather and its winds are stable. It's an ideal location for launching rockets. Hell yeah, gotta love a space base. I wish ordinary people could go into space one day. That would be amazing. You can go up to the stratosphere, but it costs you like a hundred grand, right? Right, we've kind of seen everything on the island, man. Uh, Steve's house is right over there. Yo! How's it going, Champion Band Morbo? The gym leader team use Psychic type Pokemon. If you go up at them with, against them with fighting or poison, they'll inflict horrible damage. Plus, they'll come out at you with outstanding combo attacks. If you want to win, you'll need to show them just how tight you are with your Pokémon. Go for it. Interesting. Okay, so what's that? We're going to need, like, Steel and Dark, I think, to get around there. I don't want to say the body that Team Aqua set up shop in Nidic Cove. I also heard that someone came along and wiped the floor with them. But Moss DP has been targeted by that Team Magma. Okay. Revive is fantastic. Give it to fainted Pokemon and the Pokemon will ar arise. But be careful, Revive doesn't restore the used PP. 
Netter dive balls are rare pokeballs that are only made in Lost Deep, but Net is effective against bug and water. Dive, bottom of the sea. Nice. Wax repel. Well, hopefully we can buy a few dive balls. Which are max out, I guess. Screw it. Yeah, sure. Talk to people in the poker center and then maybe go back. The gym leaders in this town are a formidable duo. Wait, duo? Is it doubles? No, that's awful. Their combo attacks are like excellent and wow. Depending on the special abilities of Pokemon, some moves might change or not work at all. Hi guys, what's the time anyway? Damn. Okay, gonna go out go out on the limb here and stick Kipper in the box and take Battle Bird. Actually, if we quickly get the team ready. Who else could join us? I could probably do the sign up while we're doing this. Let's have a think, guys. Rock could be decent, actually. Ghost, I don't think. Ah, oh, but it is ghost and dark. Mm. Tricky. Yeah, surely that's alright, no? Yeah, we'll work on it. Right, guys, decent bit of advancement in the plot today. So, yeah, I don't know, we'll save outside the space station and see what happens. So, if you like the looks of any of the suggested videos flooding your screen at this very second, then check some of them out. And more importantly, let me know what you thought, because no evolution feedback is hella good feedback. Speaking of zero evolutions, we actually did, not long ago, a Fire Red Double Evolutions Only playlist, so check that out if you're interested. Of course, if you've missed any of the Grand Emerald No Evolution runs so far, then catch up. But the main thing is, as always, guys, I hope you're well. Thanks for watching, damn not tweets, and see you again next time.